Hi everyone, Melissa here from Collecting Dreamcatcher, and today I have a new and exciting video where I'm going to be storing some new photo cards. Well, I guess they're the AR photo set, so I guess it doesn't completely count as photo cards, but um, we're going to be storing them in my miscellaneous uh, official Dreamcatcher binder. So let's get started. So what I want to do for these, since they come in an envelope, is I want it. I want to store it similar to how I did Handong's. Um, dream theater and I think I'm gonna put it second so I think I'm gonna start that and this section here with some more two pages so I'm thinking similarly to Handong's is I'm gonna put the envelope in the top one. Oh no will it not fit <laughs> it does fit it just took some fancy maneuvering it fits perfectly in this and then I'm going to put the group photo card, one below it. And then after that, I'm going to do it by member in age order. So there we go. There's the first page. And next we're going to do the two GU ones. So I think I'm going to do, um, I think I'm going to do hand hard on the top and then finger hard on the bottom. I don't think I'm going to have like a rhyme or reason really for this. <laughs> There we go, so there's GU's page. And I'll do a flip through, obviously, at the end. So you can see how it turned out. And then next we'll have Sua. And I think I'm gonna do the heart one on top and the finger one on the bottom, kind of similarly to um, GU's. That's what I think I'll do. They're probably the bigger pose on the top and then the smaller one on the bottom, if that makes sense. <laughs> There we go. And next we're going to do Xi'an, so I think top and then bottom photo. And there's her page. Then we have Yu Hian, so I think I'm going to make this one the top photo and then this one the bottom photo. And there's her page. I'm kind of sad that these aren't more exciting on the back, but that's okay. Then next we have Dami and I think top and then bottom photo, I think. There's really no reason to this, I'm just <laughs> kind of picking one. I'm happy that this is the last um, OT6 photo set, and from now on, it'll be OT7. Because <laughs> those comeback photos with Handong, like, they really um, just felt so complete. It was awesome. And then we have Gahyan. So I'm going to put this one on the top and then this one on the bottom. And there's her page. Now I'll do a quick flip through so we can see how it goes from Handong's with the um, envelope on the top. And then it goes to the Dreamcatcher um, KCON envelope group picture. Then the member sets. I kind of like it. I feel like it ties both Handong and Dreamcatcher, like their solo things, or Handong solo things, and then their group things all together. Hey, So, that's how I'm going to be storing these, and I really like the way it looks. I think it turned out really well, and this fit perfectly, and I'm so happy it did. <laughs> so that's everything for this video. It's a little bit shorter, um, but I have been releasing kind of longer videos for a while, so I figured I'd give everyone a break and just do a nice, quick little video. Um, to share how I'm going to be storing the K-Contact um, merch and 
yeah, so I hope everyone enjoyed. If you like collecting K-pop and collecting Dreamcatcher content, then please subscribe to my channel. I make new videos every Saturday, and I'll see you in my next one. Thank you, everyone. Bye. Stay safe.